Spence. Thanks, Mark. I am full on Irish, but I've been banned from expressing my Irish accent because it turns out more piratish. But I'm hanging out with Michelle Cohen from Cohen's Events, and she's here to tell us how you can do some last minute saves if you want to do something to celebrate St. Patrick's Day in your house. So thanks for hanging out with us today. Hello. Ah, all right. So uh, we're feeling Irish. We got our green on. Pinching not allowed, maybe. Maybe but, a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> but what are we working with? You know what? We normally do something that's expensive. St. Patrick's Day is in the middle of the week this week. I went by the dollar store. I was talking to the producer, and we figured we'd get some stuff that you could pick up on your way home. The dollar store? Yes, the actual dollar store. All of these items you see, except for this, comes from the dollar store. Even this, the kids can get in on it. Hey. This is all dollar store. Now, Jessica Morgan is a big proponent of the dollar, or any of the dollar stores. I've actually discovered how awesome they can be. Because, you know, a lot of people are like, I'm not going in there. But if you can come out with all of this. Yes. Like, I'm looking at this. I'm betting you spent less than 20 bucks. Less than 10. Oh, wow. What are we looking at? You're looking at your pots. All of these pots were a dollar. The corns were a dollar. The uh, napkins were a dollar. You can even get these, hey, look at the eye of it. <laughs> mugs to drink your beer in for a dollar. Make you some green tea. I got some food coloring from the Dollar Tree. Pour it in there. It's green. You can have a good Irish. And you don't have to have so much. Yeah. You know, just a little bit for a couple of people just to come over, have some good food, some wings, some finger food or something, and just enjoy. Well, and it's interesting. I saw you actually dress these mugs up right before we started with some stickers. From the Dollar Tree. And then I, we were talking about, like, you know, maybe not necessarily St. Patrick's related, but we uh, were like, oh, you know, if I need some drinking glasses and stuff, you can get these mugs there at the Dollar Tree. That's right. Oh, my goodness. It's a lot you could do to actually dress your table up for your guests at home if you want to keep it under 20 bucks. The next segment we'll do, we'll do something different, and we'll show you what you can do from the dollar stores, your local dollar stores. And then also with this, it's like, yes, you can buy this, but like we said, you dress this up so you can do your own decor. Yes. And how awesome is it that you can kind of do this kind of thing so simple, so cheap for St. Patty's Day or any of the upcoming holidays? Really, it is awesome to be able to do it because it's a lot of fun. Yeah. I do it all the time, you know, on the high end, but I want people when they can't get to me to know how they can do it and it look just as nice. You know, call me up, I can tell you, but. Go to the dollar store, take your time. Pick a little of this, pick a little of that, whatever suits your taste is what I always say. I like it. Well, this is just a little bit of what Michelle does. She's always got events going on, whether it's baby showers, gender reveals, you say it's going hot and heavy with all of that stuff. Ooh. With the COVID, we're getting a lot of requests for baby showers and gender reveals. We can talk more about that. Actually, I want somebody to write in, what is this horn on on this hat? I don't know what this horn is with Irish, but we're going to do some research on that. But <laughs> right now, uh, if you want to know more, go to coensevents.com to see what she's got going on right now mark and jessica find out what these horns are for please they 